divide x cubed minus 1 by x minus 1. Okay, uh, you can write this problem this way, all right? And um, actually, let's copy it down up here and put some space between the x cubed and the minus 1 because we have some missing terms here, okay? We're missing an x squared term, okay? So if we put that there, we, have, we don't have any of them. We have zero of them. And we have x cubed, x squared, then we need an x term, and I have zero of those also. Okay, so if we supply the missing terms, we have x cubed, x squared, and we have x to the first power, and then negative 1. Now, there are four steps to a division problem. We're going to divide, multiply, subtract, and bring down. And we have a little grid here to help us do this. Now, we're, going to talk, we're talking about dividing x cubed by x, so let's do that. That's going to go x squared times, okay? You cancel one of these x's out, gives you an x squared. We're going to multiply now x minus 1 times x squared, okay? x minus 1 times x squared. And we're going to get x cubed, okay, minus 1x squared. That's, that's what you get when you multiply x squared times x minus 1. You get x cubed, and you have your minus, and we have 1 times x squared. All right? Now, when we subtract, we change the signs of both of these. So right now, this is a plus, and this is a minus. This changes to a minus, and this goes to a plus. So that when we actually do this, um, we're going to add 1 plus 0 and get 1. Now, when you add like terms, you get a like term, and then we're going to bring down the 0x. All right, and then we're going to do our four steps again. We brought down the 0x. Now we're going to take 1x squared divided by the x. Put that over here, okay? And that's going to go x times. So x goes up here. And then take x times x minus 1, which will be x squared minus 1x. That'll go right here. x squared minus 1x. To subtract, we change these signs from a plus minus to a minus plus. We add 1 plus 0 and get 1. Okay? That's 1x. Then we're going to bring down the negative 1. Then we're going to divide 1x by x. Okay? We brought down the negative 1. Divide 1x by x. It's going to go one time. Okay? 1 times x minus 1, okay? 1 times this divisor over here. That gives me x minus 1. Okay, to subtract, we change the signs, all right? And we get 0 when we're, we're finished here. There's no remainder. So my answer is x squared plus x plus 1. And there's nothing to bring down.